We appreciate the ability to speak at length with the candidates and provide a forum for them to discuss their perspectives on the office and its relationship to both the legal profession and the people of Maryland generally. But I've been for about the last 20 years teaching and, st and studying both the Maryland Constitution and the Constitution of the United States. It's really my desire to return the state and return our culture to a, a constitutional form of government and an, ex and, and an understanding of, of what law is and what law isn't. Um, because I feel like we have been, we've suffered through uh, two years of uh, great lawlessness. The real question I think we're kicking around is the court over the Constitution or is the Constitution over the court? That's, the, that's really what, what we're asking. So in, in and the fidelity is, my fidelity as an attorney general is not, is not to, a, to any particular judge or any particular court. My fidelity is to the, to the document. In the American understanding of law and government, in, in our American system, and the, the documentation of this is, is, is there. Um, there, there are two standards to determine whether something is lawful. One is whether or not it meets the, meet, not what the court said, but whether it, whether it meets the, the constitutional limitations of, of government, and also whether, whether it, is, uh, it has to be harmonious with God's law. Well, Maryland General Assembly said this and that, and they might say something else next, next month, and the court might say something else next month. The idea that law evolves, like you're suggesting, is like, t is like a, a Dar Darwinian view of the law. The other, but I don't think our founders had that. I don't think America is founded on that understanding. That understanding is that law, law is fixed, and, and there is there is an absolute truth. That's why you can say things like all men are created equal, and they're endowed by their creator with, with rights. And it's the job of government to secure these rights. Governments are instituted among men. That's why you can say that because there is a standard. 